This tutorial is on placing an interlibrary loan request through Illion. To place an interlibrary loan request, you must first log into your Illion account. Remember, although your Illion login may be the same as your UTAD username, your password will probably be different. Once you've logged into the Illion, you can use the New Request feature menu at the left to choose the appropriate request form. There are forms for articles, books, if not available through the OhioLink catalog, individual scans of book chapters, conference papers published in proceedings, as well as other formats. If your document type isn't listed, use the other format and give as much information as you know. For any of the forms, enter as much information as you know. Anything with a red asterisk is required. But the more information you enter, such as volume or issue numbers, will help us and the lending library be sure we get the correct item. Optionally, you can also enter information about where you found the citation. In case we need to go back to that source and verify your information, press Submit to enter your request when the form is complete. Each form may require different information specific to that publication format. You may also enter information in this form using the Find It button, found next to each result or abstract in many of the university's databases or subscriptions. For example, here in an EBSCO database, we can click on Find It and then use the Get Copy via Interlibrary Loan link. Since we're already logged into our Iliad account, it has filled out the form for us and we must only submit the request. Google Scholar will show either Find It with O links or Ohio Link O links uh, next to each citation. These two will lead to the Iliad form. If you're on campus, these should show automatically. If you're off campus, you can go to the Advanced Settings in Scholar to set this up. This will take us exactly where we were before, and we can click on Get Copy for Interlibrary Loan. Again, the information will be filled out. Thank you for watching this tutorial, and good luck placing your interlibrary loan requests.